a lot of things just don't uh, don't feel right. Have you ever thought about taking your own life? Yeah. I mean, I would never do it. I just uh, I feel so down sometimes. Have you uh, seen a psychiatrist? Uh, not in about a year. Uh, I was on medication, but I wanted to get off them as soon as I joined the church. Huh. Maybe you should go back on them. You could still come to church. I thought God would manage it. There's nothing saying he can't use medication to help us. I'm pretty pissed off here, Pete. Can I call you Pete? Yeah, Peter's good. Why are you upset? Well, I signed up to host this event at my home. I have five acres out in Schoharie. It's beautiful. And now Rich wants to have it at his house. I talked to Joe about it, and Joe, he is completely useless. Who, who's Joe? Oh, he's another member of the men's group. How many members are there in the men's group? Just the three of us. So why do you think the both of them want to meet at Rich's house? Well, probably because it's closer. Close is good, you know. What's the problem? The problem is, we are trying to draw closer to God here. And I think nature helps. These guys, they don't get it. Okay, well, I think that the setting is really important. Right? Yeah. But I also think it's very important that you have a spirit of one accord. Because if you guys are fighting with each other during the meeting, how are you going to draw close to the Lord? <laughs> I don't know, Pete. I think nature is pretty important. Well. People have been really supportive. I just feel like I don't know how to be supportive. I mean, he, he doesn't want to talk to me about this. I mean, look, I, I know how close you were with your sister. And I just want you to open up with me so I can help you too. This whole thing is ridiculous. I'm supposed to talk to you and... And you? What are you, 20? I'm 35. Listen, if it doesn't help, it doesn't help. But let's give it a try. Look, I'm going through a hard time right now. Uh, and neither one of you... Uh, have siblings, so you, you can't possibly understand what I'm going through right now. I mean, have you ever lost anyone that was close to you? Somebody that you loved? I, I lost my wife and child. So let's talk to him. You know, maybe, maybe it's not the time to talk. Let's just pray, all right? And then if you want, Mike, uh, you can talk, you know, next week. See you guys next week for Sunday. Hey, uh, I wanted to say thanks for putting uh, all those appointments in my calendar. I, uh, but you don't, you know, you don't have to do that. You can just write them down. I'll put them in. Oh, I usually always do it just so we don't double book. That's smart. Is there something you needed? Ah, uh, no. Um, well, you know, so I, I kind of need to get to know the area here a little bit better. And, uh, I was wondering if you might want to show me around town and I would buy you a coffee. When? Saturday? I'll get back to you about it tomorrow. Shannon. Oh, hi, Bree. How are you? Good. How are you? Uh, is Pete here? Oh, Lord, please help me. Yeah. Did you have an appointment? Uh, no. We just had a little coffee date yesterday, and he said he likes cheesecake, so I thought I would bring him one. Hey, Shannon. Hey, I thought I heard your voice. Hey, Pete. I brought you some cheesecake. I know you said you like it. Oh, thank you. I do like cheesecake. I was saying I like the Cheesecake Factory, though. Oh, well, 
so do I. We should go. How about Saturday? Oh, you know what? I have plans on Saturday. Well, what are you doing? I'm hopefully going to be exploring the city. Oh, well, let me be your guide. Uh, well, you know, I asked Bree to. Well, we should all go. We can make it a group thing. I'll invite the singles group, and uh, we could all go. It'd be fun. Plus, you want to know the ladies anyway. Is the singles group all ladies? It is. Not a lot of single men in the church. Well, let me talk to Bree about it, and I'll get back to you. Well, what do you think, Bree? Sound fun? I actually can't do Saturday. I said I'd get back to you about it. Well, we will show you around. Let's make a day of it. Are you sure you can't go, Bree? Yeah. That is too bad. Well, listen, I've got to run back to work, so uh, I'll see you Saturday. And uh, hey, why don't you give me your number, and then we can text the details. Oh, it's long distance. Oh, that's fine. It's all free now. So, Pastor Pete? It's Peter. It's uh, 202-435-5946. Okay, I've sent you mine. Well, gotta run. Okay, thank you. Yeah, you know, I, I feel really bad here. I, I was hoping we could go out and get to know each other a little better. Well, you could get to know the singles group. Maybe you could even lead the group. They'll keep you busy. Do you want to go to dinner on Friday night? I don't really like the happy hour crowd. It's just too noisy. Me neither. We should go a little later. N no, I don't think so. It's okay. You guys have fun. <laughs>